Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology Channel, and as we talk about new features for 25H2, another feature that seems to be one that will be implemented, it is a power saving mode. Now we'll say, well, there's already a power saving mode in Windows, and there's already uh, some work being done in the background when you don't use your PC to try to throttle the PC a little. Uh, it is true that there are some of these power settings and power plans that are actually being tweaked depending on what you choose as a power plan and the different options in the power settings and so on. But uh, PCs can actually go a step further and they've never really gone there for most part. Because depending on the manufacturer, the motherboard you have, the device you have, the laptop you have, there are ways to really throttle down the power. And Microsoft says that it wants to uh, add, and it's starting to be tested again in the insider rings, a new power saving feature that will throttle down the CPU speed, throttle down every hardware that can be throttled down to save energy will be put to the bare minimum when the Windows operating system notices that for um, you know, a certain amount of time, a few minutes, you haven't touched or done anything on the PC. Of course, this will take into account that, you know, you might be uh, on a web page, you might be looking at a video, you might be doing something, even though you're not interacting with the PC at, uh, at such. And it, it apparently will be intelligent enough to know that your PC is doing something. So if you're looking at, you know, a Netflix movie, uh, it knows that you're streaming something, that your video playback, or it knows that your browser is open on a web page. Things like that will uh, mean that the computer will not interfere with that and touch anything. But once it finds out that nothing is happening, you haven't touched your PC, interacted in any way, it will throttle down the CPU, throttle down all of the uh, features, the electronics that can be saving power. Uh, they say that this actually will amount to a lot of power saved as PCs are actually quite power hungry when they are working. So um, this will help also on your power bill. Uh, that's another aspect that they're talking about. If you have more than one PC, for example, you might see a difference on the, uh, the, uh, the bill uh, at the end of the month because all other PCs will be saving energy when they're not uh, in use. And, but still turned on. And of course, all of that will come back to normal. So what happens is that once you touch your mouse, once you click something and go somewhere on the internet or whatever you're doing on your PC suddenly, the PC will simply put everything back to the speed, the maximum speed that you want it to be so that it won't interfere and apparently you really won't notice when it changes from you know a uh, low power consumption to uh, going back to normal. So that's coming up 25H2 also. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.